Welcome back to part 20 of Final Fantasy XIII. And the last time I beat the Scale Beast, I beat him. I did it. This time, I want to show you something cool. I mentioned how there's like a free camera, I guess, in the Crystarium screen. But it actually resets. It's kind of cool. I just assumed it would stay that way. It's it's a uh, high-quality camera, <laughs> I, I guess. Uh, in the interim between episodes, I got Fira for Vanille here, and I got an accessory slot for old buddy Saz. Uh, there it is. Let me see what we can synergize, synthesize rather. Anything, 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 anything? Resist. I might do that just to get that magic and that defense. That'd be crazy. Uh, magic wall. I don't really need that. So yeah, we'll just go with black belt. Uh, strength could be good. I might switch off to the power wristband, but for now we'll do black belt. Black belt. Black. <laughs> oh god. Cutscene. 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 Jump in the cutscene. I mean, wasn't she the one who drew the line in the sand so we wouldn't cross it? Like, that's just kind of a real character flip. Come on now. Being made of the sea, it's not easy. I mean, look. Even I'm kind of worried. <laughs> but even if we don't know what'll happen, we have to keep our dreams alive. Have something to look forward to. You know? Next stop is Nautilus, City of Dreams. Party change? You might think we're getting some sweet solo vanilla gameplay. Check out those paradigms. Check out those paradigms, really? That's so sad. <laughs> Four Ravagers, one saboteur, one medic. Like what do you what do you want from me? Uh he's actually over here. Can you go this way? I don't even know. Can you? What's she gonna say? Oh no, the bird shows up. That's what I thought. You don't wanna leave Saz behind? I love how she doesn't mind. Like, that implies that she would leave him behind. But the bird is what brings her back. That's great. Like, <laughs> it's a bird. <laughs> okay, you go, Seth. I'm going to continue on my journey. I don't want to watch more cuts. Look at those flowers, though. That's great. Sonic Adventure. Sonic CD. Good future. Seth. You scared me. What's up? I'm just thinking. Don't blame yourself. You know, you can't control who a Falci picks for a focus. My son Dodge. <laughs> he was picked. He's a Lassie. He said he wanted to see a foul sea, so I took him to go on a tour of the Uriday Gorge plant. Thought I'd surprise him with a chocobo chick to take home, but the second I turned my back, into the energy plant he went. Dodge! Dodge, come out here! Dodge! 
I know you're in here. Dodge! <coughs> Where are you? Say something! Dodge! Hey, what's wrong, Doc? Dodge! Daddy! Uh, it's all right. You okay? You're not hurt, are you? What's that? Apparently, those post Lassi had snuck in and tried to attack the Sanctum Falci. It did the only thing it could and made Dodge and Lassi to protect it. My son, he got picked by a Sanctum Falci. He's a hero. But where Pulse Lassi? Dodge's enemies. Psychom showed up right after that to take custody of him. And then, it was one test after another. Even then, they couldn't figure out his focus. Maybe it was look for Pulse Lassi. Maybe it was kill him. Either way, how could a kid that young even stand a chance? After he was made a Lassi, Dodge had some way of sensing things from Pulse. He was the one who found the Pulse Foul C. But the kid can't fight. So, that's why I put myself on the train to Purgeville. I figured his focus had to have something to do with destroying that Pulse Foul C. Thought I could do it for him, and, well, you know the rest. If I was right about his focus, he's probably a crystal already. Of course, if he was supposed to take out that thing's Lassie, then either we die, or he's a Seath. Die? Really? <sighs> it's a pickle, all right. Bird, the bird says no. I may or may not have been reading about Smash uh, 3.1 this whole time, so don't mind me. I think I'm gonna record some of that later. I was playing on it earlier uh, to test out some of the changes. Luckily, my gal Pally was not nerfed. Wasn't even touched. Nest? No, no, no nuffs. No nerfs. What is that? So this is an orb. It's an orb. Orb! It changes the weather. Because like uh, everything else. Huh, a device what? that makes bad weather. Yeah. There's two basic there's two playable modes in this area. You can either have rain, you can have sun. Uh, the enemies change depending on what you have. Come out to play in the rain, I wanna say the Rain are generally harder, but Isn't there's one of those uh, feeding stoop, flying, winged, uh, something or other enemies with like the, the chimera tail and the two faces and all that mess. Yeah, there's two of those guys. Um, but yeah, that's the thing. You can basically choose your playstyle. God, more slowdown. Uh, we're gonna start off with this. I'll see. We'll see what happens. Oh, more of these to clear out. Come on now. Come on now. I'll clear those out in between episodes. Alright, let's see. Preempt preemptive, let's go. Alright, I think mud frog is new, hedgehog is not new. You wanna take out the mud frog because the mud frog is uh, I think you can summon enemies. I might be wrong, but even if you can't summon enemies, it doesn't matter. Just take him out because he's the big boy. He's the big boy. He's the big boy. Hit him with that, hit him with that, hit him with that. What? What was that? My, oh, I hit the wrong button. I didn't realize that they moved when I got the new spell. It pushed Aurora over. That's unfortunate. That's very unfortunate. Alrighty. And slash and burn. Yeah, I'll leave the mug frog later. Uh, or just look at his information. I don't remember what he does, but he's not that special. Courtship Dance either summons or it buffs. It's one of the two. It's not good for us, though. 
Um, let's see. Oh, look, you can see all the way out there. You can't even get those guys. Like, you can't fight those guys out there. But they at least put them there. Because why wouldn't they be over there? So here you go. Scale Beast plus... Uh, Gremlin. Oh, re... Are you kidding me, B? Are you kidding me, B? Yo. My controller, it's right here. Yo, is this the end of the episode? This might be the end of the episode. This just might be... I don't have an... I don't have a wire. I don't have a freaking cable. Oh, that's why. Hold up, let's try... Oh, that's... No, that's the... Here we go. Can we do this? Dude, this is peak professionalism right here. Alright. Take the battery out. Put the battery back in. Oh, wait, did that do it? It did. Okay, cool. I don't know. Are my batteries dead? It didn't even tell me low battery. That's annoying. <laughs> Peak professionalism. Alright, we're going to change this back to this thingy, though, because... Wait, it's still flashing? Why are we still flashing? My Xbox is still flashing. I don't get it. I don't play the Xbox enough to know what its lights mean. I really don't, which is a shame. Alright, let's hop up here. And, alright, we gotta fight these guys. We gotta fight these guys. He's their item required. What? You weren't even looking at me. You weren't even looking at me, but their item required, so we'll fight them. It might be worthwhile to use the syringes here. It might. It might. But, uh, I'm not. we too cool for that. ATB refresh. And Fira is really helpful for these large groups because it at least does a little damage, some residuals to everybody. Uh, you gotta get the stagger. Alright, I might use the synergist. I just might. I might use the synergist. Screw it. Screw it. Cure, cure, cure. Give me some vigilance so I don't get interrupted. Alright, we're back. We back. Definitely not five stun in this one. Definitely not five stun in this one. Ready. And watch Rinse Repeat. See, they're not. If I can. Here we go. Stagger, stagger, stagger. Nice. Nope, that's the wrong button. That was wrong, wrong. Number of up presses, whatever. It'll still work. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Poison might be one of my favorite viewers, quite frankly. It's good to just have. Like, it's nice to just do, because it does damage, you know? You can't beat residual damage, but... Oh, we still fought. Get that mess up out of here. I'm a five-star G like Birdman. <laughs> Remember that album? Oh, my God. That's something I don't think I mentioned uh, before. I hate having Vanille, or I hate having Ravagers in the lead position. It's very, very annoying. Whoa, wait a second. Hop back up there, hop back up there, hop back up there. You see him? You see He's up there? Wait, is he? See, he's right there. Let's see. Does he, does he move? Oh, no, it's just perspective change. Okay. That's fine. You can touch that thing, and it will uh, move this guy out the way. I'm going to try to fight him, because why not? Uh, but I usually don't like having Ravagers or non-commandos in the lead. But with Vanille and the fact that she has Saboteur, she's basically a commando. Now, Hope, you'll never catch me using him in the lead if I have the option not to, because he just doesn't do anything for me. He can't do anything good. He's trash. All right, this guy, weak to arrow, weak to fire, half damage on ruin, so I won't do that too much. I will get a, get one of those going. And give me some synergy. I like that. I want that magic. Fight. I'm dead. Am I dead? I might be dead. Yes. Alright, we had to, had to lose at some point. I'm sorry. I love that she apologizes. Like, 
that makes a difference. Oh god, I thought I hit quit. I'm good. Alright. So, hmm. How do we want to tackle this? I mean, he doesn't have any spells that make a difference defensively. I might just skip this dude. I might. We'll try it one more time. We'll try it one more time. Try it one more time. Oh, wow. Oh, okay. I was going to say. You have to kind of attack his shadow, as with most flying enemies. You attack the shadow and you can engage them. Alright, just keep me healed. Keep me healed. Wait, why are you buffing yourself? Saz does not make any sense. Alright, if he can attack or attract the dude, that should help at least. Um, undermine? Poison, get that poison, can I get that poison? There we go. Do one more round. Get the shell on everybody, or on him rather. Alright, now we dual cast. Now we dual cast. Interrupt, 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 interrupt. Thank you. That's the beauty of uh, having vigilance and. Interrupt him, interrupt him, interrupt him, interrupt him. Oh god. Stagger, here we go. Get that full staggered. Get that get that full staggered and keep that full staggered. Because I have low defenses, so I might just get hit. I might get hit. Snitches so get hit. We're good. We did it. We're good. We are good. We're golden. Staggering is the craziest, best. Oh my god! Oh, that was close! That was close! Oh my god, that was so close. <laughs> that was inches away from death. That was inches away from death. That was awesome. Yo, stagger, staggering enemies is like the greatest innovation in this game. I love it because it makes for such more, so much more compelling battles. You have to engage with the targets in the way that you never had to before. It's a matter of you might get that stagger and you. Oh crap! Jump over here! Jump! Jump over here! Now you might have to uh, change up your battle plan because he's he has some other ability that gets unlocked when he gets staggered, or you know that you can attack him more when he's staggered. It's, it's so invigorating. Exhilarating, even. Oh, I've used the wrong. That's my worst habit, honestly. Not changing paradigms. When battles start, it's the worst. Alright, I'm keeping this in because these item, this is item required. Uh, are these different? Oh no, these guys just come in different sizes. That's kind of cool. I know some of these guys. I, whoa, you see how they just slid apart? Uh, I know some of these guys you can they can like absorb each other and they grow into bigger flam flandragors. Oh yeah, flans are Final Fantasy enemies, right? I think they are. Sounds familiar at least. That bubbling sounds so disconcerting. Like it makes sense because they're goofy and whatnot, but still. Come on, come on. Oh what? You're not done here? I thought you were done here. Symbiosis, heal me, heal me, heal, 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 heal! heal. <laughs> the one thing I'll take from HD Bailey. It's <laughs> like my favorite thing he does. You gotta heal. Okay. And... Come on. You got stagger. Or HD refresh. And you're done. Alright, what do we get? We better get a good item. I hope we get a good item. Murky ooze. Oh, what do you give me? Is it probably gonna be like two vials of murky ooze or something? Aqua ring. Oh, that's important. That's important. That's important for the next battle. Uh. Oop. I'll just throw it on her so I don't forget. And throw that up. And, oh, new guys. Um, let's see, Christarian, what are we looking at? Let's get the roll level. Let's just get the roll level. There we go. So she's maxed out there. Saboteur, we can almost get the roll level. What about Saz? What about Siaz? 
Uh, Rav? Nothing. Alright, so let's just hop into this. I think the other guys, the guys in the background, I think they're the ones who can summon or do dangerous magic. Let's find out. Garchimera. Garchimera. They can do something. Maybe they're unremarkable. I don't know. But they have different colored coats on, so they must be important. I love how he walks over and flutters his wings at me like that's really gonna do something. Take out the, not him, take out the other, I kind of want to take out the little guy, I don't, wait, what do the, that's huge powerful, okay, maybe take out the, the fancy thing. maybe take him out. I don't know what he can do, maybe it's stage 3 magic, but he definitely has a charge up attack, I really don't remember his, what his claim to fame is, oh, fear, I mean, fear, yeah, I guess fear is kind of scary, but, not when you have tiny little feet that doesn't let you approach that don't let you approach your enemies that quickly. He's just, he's just like sauntering over there all casually. Alright, more of these guys. Let's uh turn back and press the button. I don't know what they replace with. It might just be more of those toad frog lizard guys. And I mean it's nice this is a nice reminder that even though this is a, a separate kind of area, can I actually creep past you? Yes, I can. Um, even though this is a separate area, it looks very wildernessy, wildernessy, wild. Um, it's still under control of the, you know, sanctum and bioengineers because these orbs are here. These aren't naturally occurring orbs. At least I don't think they are. Uh, we're just gonna slide through those DMs. Slide through all those DMs. And uh, I think we're going to call it a part here. I wanted to do this in three episodes, but uh, there's a boss battle, and I don't want to I don't have to, have to retry that at the end of an episode. So thank you very much for watching. Next time, we will uh, have all these little data log things cleared out and uh, see what lies in store for our tandem characters. Tandem of characters? Spoiler alert, it's a tandem boss fight. Oh, boy. As always, thanks for watching. I will see you in the next one. Have a great day. Look at Lightning just staring at you. Do better. That's what she's saying. That's what she's thinking about. Do better.